So I have patients that come in and say they're going to Europe and they're going to do a lot of walking on cobblestones. Um, what would you, rather than a sandal that we wear here in Florida, what would you right. recommend for those people going to? So the, the, this shoe here, this is Archipedico. This has been a great travel shoe. And this has been good because, of the, especially in the black, you can be wearing a skirt and still wear the shoe. And if it gets wet, you can just dry it in the room. Mm -hmm. So this has been one of our top travel shoes, which is why we have it in 25 colors. I mean, I wouldn't carry a shoe if it wasn't a good seller in that many colors. So, and then the boots have been great because the, you can spray them and waterproof them. But, you know, when, you, when you're traveling, a lot of times it can be cold and then it can be hot. And so this shoe can kind of be versatile in both in both situations. And then we have our heavier boots, depending on where you're going. And then we have this, what we talked about earlier, a tennis shoe that's got support in NAO. Then you can move over from what you wore in a sandal. This is going to be similar support in a boot. So in our boots, we don't typically get into too heavy, but we do carry some that are waterproof. So it's like a flush lining there? Yep. Oh, okay. Yeah. I thought it was just holes in it. So let's go to the other side. Come on, Sue. I do get a lot of people that love this brand. This brand is probably one of our top selling lines because it's colorful and because it's supportive as far as comfort wise where a lot of people that want fashion when they go shop in a fashion more of a fashion shoe store the toe bit, the toe part is too narrow so most of our shoes that's how they get in the comfort category it means the the, the box here is wider and then the heels aren't drastically high so it's just that medium heel and uh, so we find a lot of people like this brand because they're fun, they're funky, they're not just your basic old, just plain shoe, a lot of detail, and then the lower heel. Now we do have some that are higher, but the person that likes this shoe, it's also nice and wide right here. You're not, your whole foot's not going down to the front. The other thing is it's got a nice high toe box too. It's not sloping down like I don't see any shoes that you have that I really point to. Yeah, we don't, and we don't carry um, that style you're talking about really. It doesn't fit, it wouldn't fall in the comfort category. I mean, even this great dress boot. Not too, a thick heel, so for stability. And then you've got the cuteness, mm -hmm. <laughs> the cute factor. Um, 